the forecast. When we look outside, it almost looks a little hazy from this picture. Yeah, it does. A little bit of moisture in the air, and we're zoomed in toward the foothills, so in the top of your screen, you'll kind of see a few billows, some clouds starting to build over the higher terrain. That'll be your afternoon showers popping up. I'll show you a radar in just a minute. One more time, check this out. No 80 degree readings at our major stations in Colorado, even really across the region except for Moab. Very remarkable for a map like this in the middle of August at noon. Normally we'd be talking about places nearing 90. Tom, 73, he's our weather watcher in Centennial. Here's the low pressure that brought us the unsettled weather and a little bit of a cool down. There it goes. It'll pull off to the east. Higher pressure will start to take over as we wrap up your work week and go into the upcoming weekend. That means a couple of things. A temperatures start to go back up, but B, moisture from the Pacific will return, and that sets the stage for those daily storms. Here is Doppler 4000. There went some showers this morning, a few more popping over the foothills. I think most of these are going to stay over the higher terrain today, but a one or two could come off the foothills and graze the I-25 urban corridor. South of Denver, Douglas County, Castle Rock, Elizabeth, you stand probably a little bit better chance of that happening. Here's future cast and it's showing this very nicely. Expect a mix of sun and clouds through the afternoon. A couple of those showers do try and come off the foothills, but I think most of you are going to stay on the dry side. We are not talking anything severe today. We should not see the hail like we saw yesterday and probably not even really heavy rain. Uh, there's just not enough forcing in the atmosphere. It's not warm enough to get those really big thunderstorms going. High temperatures today. We should go up a few more degrees. I think we'll land in the 70s, primarily along an east of I-25. A few communities could touch the 80s uh, down southeast. Mountains, 60s and 70s, and 70s out west. Grand Junction, you'll probably climb on into the 80s today, maybe about 86 or 87 degrees. Here's Denver's five-day forecast, 76 today. Very small chance for a brief afternoon shower or storm. Tomorrow, 84. Plenty of sunshine around 87. Friday should also be a nice sunny end to the week. But over the weekend, it'll feel like it should for August. Temperatures in the upper 80s and that chance for an afternoon thunderstorm. If you want to have a pool day, get it scheduled. I think the next few days are looking good for that. <laughs> okay, Chris, thank you so sure. much. Coming up, we'll meet